Hello XDC family and welcome back to Crypto Ready. If you want to be ready for crypto, then you are in the right place. Today we're going to be talking about XDC. We will be looking at XDC's connection to Visa, one of the biggest global payments technology company. We will also touch upon some massive updates coming to XDC 2.0, which includes tons and tons of liquidity. Finally, we're going to be talking about your chance to invest in DeFi technology, a publicly traded company leading the DeFi race. So I hope you will watch to the end. We shall continue right after this intro. Looking at coin market cap, currently the total market cap is 2.28 trillion, up by about 2%. The rest of the market is slightly in the green, Bitcoin at 64k and Ethereum at 2.6k. Once again, we can see that the total market cap of the crypto industry is slowly climbing, but nothing interesting is happening in regards to the crypto prices. So even now, guys, at these low prices, you still have a massive opportunity to DCA in to your favorite cryptos. Looking at some important crypto news, crypto advocate Mark Cuban eyes replacing Gary Gensler as SEC chair. And yes guys, I totally agree. Let me know what you think about this in the comment section. But I totally believe that Gary Gensler's time is up. He has ridiculed crypto for far too long and it's time for a change. And I believe someone like Mark Cuban who has a lot of these investments in crypto, who is a crypto advocate, is best place to take over. But either way guys, regardless of what happens in the world, in regards to who wins elections, doesn't matter what country you're in, crypto is gonna flourish in your country. Crypto is gonna be global and you know it, right? Crypto is that future currency. As you will see in today's video, a lot of the connections we have today, especially for XDC, how clearly it's moving forward with some of the biggest names. The big boys want to save money, right? Who doesn't want to save money? You want to make a transaction any time of the day, instantly, without any fees. And as you guys already know, XTC is well placed to take over a lot of the value movement that's going to be happening globally. So I hope you're prepared, guys, because the world is moving forward into a pro crypto friendly environment. And just before we continue, guys, I now have an Instagram account. The link is at the top of the video right now. Please follow me because I put a lot of good videos related to crypto and the future of crypto. So don't miss out. Looking at the XDC chart, currently XDC is at 0.28 cents. And as you can see, we are hovering with the rest of the market. Right now, everything is tied down to Bitcoin. But guys, mark my words, in the very near future, we will decouple from Bitcoin utility will rise on its own. Once we are no longer tied to Bitcoin, I think utility will be rising far faster than Bitcoin has ever risen in its lifetime. But this is a conversation for another video, guys. But right now, guys, at 2.8 cents, you can't go wrong by buying more XDC. It's never financial advice, guys. This is exactly what I am doing. I'm loading up my bags while I still can for these massive discounts. Looking at a tweet from Symmetry7, Visa partners with Consensus to help bridge CBDC networks with existing payment rails. XDC, yes, highly involved. Consensus plus JP Morgan, who was involved in Quorum, plus CBDC, plus Visa. So how big is Visa? In 2023 alone, Visa processed 283 billion transactions valued at $15.1 trillion. So as we can see from these numbers, guys, Visa is not a small player in the world of value movement. But this is only gonna get bigger with the involvement of blockchain and crypto. So Visa is now stepping up its game, right? It's helping the banks be ready for this new tokenization of assets and smart contracts, which is the future technology. It is partnering with people like Consensus, who is highly connected to JP Morgan, and JP Morgan is highly connected with XDC. This is a snowball effect, right? It's gonna affect XDC the most because XDC is working tirelessly to help move that value effortlessly. 
seamlessly and for a zero cost. Some more connections guys, Consensus acquires Quorum which was created by JP Morgan and XDC is a blockchain which is a fork of Quorum. So can you see the connections here? We are connected to some of the biggest institutions in the world and they are working with Visa now. Visa is going to bring hundreds of trillions in the longer term to the blockchain because blockchain is the damn future. So be prepared guys because over the next few months to years we are going to see the floodgates open for liquidity that is going to be moving through the XDC network. Looking at a tweet from XDC Foundation, let's explore some of the key features in XDC 2.0 that will expand the network's capabilities and strengthen its ecosystem. USDC Bridge with Circle Now, bridging USDC to XDC network will significantly expand liquidity and unlock new opportunities in DeFi, tokenized assets and even more. Imagine us being tied to the USDC having that bridge with USDC and Circle. How much value is that going to bring to the XDC network? Now, that would be telling guys. But wait, there's more. Another bridge with the USDT and Tether. This will further increase liquidity across the network. Although it's still in its early stages, the release of the USDT bridge will open a wide range of opportunities across the ecosystem. Did you hear that guys? More and more liquidity is coming to the XDC network. And imagine what that is going to do to the XDC price. I obviously speculate that it is going to have a positive effect on the price of XDC. And finally, something that we have been talking about over the last few weeks is about the XDC network fees. They are ridiculously low. They are almost non-existent. But this upgrade to XDC 2.0 will bring a modest increase to ensure security and performance. What are the big boys looking for in today's markets? They are looking for something fast, efficient, secure, cheap to use, 24-7, instant finality, all those good words. And XDC fits in perfectly to what the big boys want. So guys, all I'm going to say here, XDC is on the path to success. At 2.8 cents, it needs to be bought. It's asking for people to buy it. Because once we move to that bull run, which we're hoping for by the end of the year, even then, guys, the price may never return to 2.8 cents. So, guys, be prepared, be ready, and diamond hands. So, we're now going to move on and talk about an investment opportunity of a lifetime. Today, we're going to be talking about something very exciting. As you guys have already heard by now, Donald Trump has consistently supported financial innovation and decentralized finance, DeFi, sits at the heart of this disruption. I bring to you DeFi technologies. They are leading the charge, helping to build the foundational infrastructure for the future of cryptocurrency. This aligns seamlessly with Trump's forward-thinking financial principles. And I know everybody's thinking, what is an ETP? An ETP is an exchange-traded product. ETPs provide investors with several benefits over buying crypto directly. First of all, you get diversity, simplicity, transparency, low fees, and security. So let's touch upon DeFi technologies. They believe that traditional investors should have the opportunity to invest in digital assets, including cryptos, in a trusted and secure manner without creating a separate brokerage or bank account. So how does DeFi technologies achieve this? They capture the upside of the explosive growth of digital assets like Bitcoin, Ethereum, Solana and other Web3 protocols via regulated equity instruments known as ETPs and they are one of the only publicly traded companies built to give investors direct exposure to these nascent markets in a regulated secure manner. So why DeFi technologies? Well they are a publicly traded company. They have an aggressive revenue model, diversified digital asset exposure and growth sectors focus. They are literally allowing you to tap 
into the extensive $2.4 trillion sector comprehensively. Looking at their business lines, how do they make money? They have Valeur Asset Management. They lead the crypto ETP market and hold a valuable regulatory license, giving them a distinct competitive advantage. And you will be excited to know that through staking and lending, they consistently achieve high returns of 8 to 10%, which is extremely rare in traditional finance. They also have an arbitrage trading desk. This trading desk has generated $97 million in revenue in just a few months, proving to be a very successful strategic move. And then finally, you have got the reflexivity research. DeFi Technologies benefits from the involvement of Anthony Pompliano. You might have heard his name by now. He is a well-known crypto enthusiast who has invested in the company and sold his consulting firm to them. His endorsement along with his alignment with Trump's financial outlook and his track record of identifying undervalued companies strengthens the company's credibility and growth outlook. Let's now talk about some numbers. What's truly exciting is that DeFi Technologies recently announced impressive financial results. $98 million in revenue and $66.5 million in net income for the last quarter. Despite this rapid growth, the company is still dramatically undervalued with a market cap of only $615 million and a low price to earnings ratio of just three. The stock represents a tremendous opportunity for investors. The potential for growth is enormous. But don't take my word for it guys, because we have got Fox Business, who has 2.63 million subscribers, telling us that DeFi Technologies is the next 20x. Listen to this quick short clip. DeFi is, a, is in the crypto space, but they, they run a bunch of ETFs over in Europe. So, and they're a small company. They're, they're less than a billion market cap. Uh, and that's one of the keys. If you want to find a 20 bagger, you got to start small. I love right. Nvidia, but to 20 bag from three trillion, that's going to be tough. Right. So DeFi is is small. It's cheap. It has something like a three x forward price price earnings uh, multiple versus people like Coinbase and Robinhood who have like 40 x forward PEs. So I think it's just going to continue to do well and perform, and people will discover it. That's why I like it. So as you just heard there, guys, we've got some of the big names talking about. DeFi Technologies. It is currently under a billion dollars in market cap and they are expecting at least a 20x. Right now, buying the DeFi Technologies stock at $2.11, you are still very early. As you can see, the one year performance has been 2,411%, which is a massive return on investment. So how do you buy the DeFi Technologies stock? First of all, you need to open a brokerage account. This is an investment account that allows you to buy and sell variety of investments, including DeFi Technologies stock. eToro is a great example of where you can buy this stock. All you gotta do is create an account and then be ready to buy this stock. I'm gonna leave all the links in the description, guys. Please do your own due diligence, invest responsibly, but just remember DeFi is the future and DeFi technology is going to be leading it.